Hey, hello, Ricardo. Thank you. Hello. Hi. I'm Kira. This is, uh, this is my wife. Sorry. The States, uh, well, I did everything from marketing consulting to you know, uh, helping with foreclosures to some teaching, but the, m the main thing I did for most of the time that I was in the U.S. was uh, se security. I worked for nine years for the University of Minnesota Police Department. It's, it's more that we have connections. We came here because Kira's best friend from high school lived in Moscow, and we she helped us get set up. Like once you are in Moscow, and once you have connections, and you have friends in the business community, yeah, no problem. You will find ways to get things done. If you come to Moscow as an American by yourself, and have no connections, and don't know how things work, and don't know where to go to get anything, it will be a horrible experience. It, it's very it's difficult, difficult to break you into. Know, yeah. If you don't have connections when you get here, uh, it is pretty difficult. Yeah. I would say scare people. I think the kids love it. Yeah. Yeah. Quite a lot. Yeah. What are many kids? Uh, yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I and I would say like the younger the kids, the more they enjoy it. Like the like the university students, like guys and girls will both stop and watch. And but the younger they get, the the, the closer they get. It's <laughs> The, my club has no training space. And so my club is fr was friends with them. And so we came, to tra we came to training here. And I've been training two times a week, every week, you know, ever since. And my club still has no space to train. And they have this park. Well, um, I mean, for me, I mean, part of it is just a connection to my actual ancestors, my my real life ancestors being Norwegians, who you know the ones that I know about, most of them like were you know farmers, fishermen, Vikings, you know the type of people that we reenact. Um, but also, it's it's just it's good exercise. This is a copy of a Roman gladiator's helm. It's a new, it's a new one. It's made from brass. Kira likes it. Fly. <laughs> a really big bug. <laughs> this is okay. where I bought my. Do you want me to hold something here? Where I bought my weapons. Where I bought my armor. Um, I have a uh, some chainmail on the way. <laughs> there. The supplier of Chainmail is a French company with factories and uh, production facilities in India where they get the iron from. You can have tempered steel that is not sharp. So all of these, all of these swords are very good quality tempered steel and uh, very good for fighting, but they're not sharp. They, they have a two millimeter edge so that they're safe. And um, or you can have a sharp sword that is not tempered. Of course, people can buy axes and machetes and things like that, but not 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 real tempered steel sharp swords. And you would like to have one real? Oh, I do. I just they're in America with my father. It was a pleasure to be here with you. It's good yeah, to meet you too. It's good to meet you. Bye bye. 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 bye